I'm kind of nervous he's going to be walking down that hallway any minute now. <laughs> Can't really see any longer, though, so I guess we're just going to hope he's not. Get in there. Okay, so we're playing Jenga with books and a hanging piano again. Shit, I gotta go right underneath it because there's carpet here. Okay, I can hide down here. It, oh, no, damn it. Want that little feller. Can't tell where he went though. I think he's back here. Can't really tell where he went. I'm just causing a bunch of noise. I want to find that little guy. Ah, oh, damn it. I mean, I lost him. I didn't pay attention to exactly where he went, so I lost him. Wait, did he go? There's nowhere, there's nothing back here, is there? Oh, God, I lost him. Well, maybe there's, maybe you can't hug every one of them, I don't know. But I can't find him. I don't really want to spend 20 minutes here looking for a little fella. I think it's optional anyway. Okay, so he apparently doesn't come in here, or if he does, it takes a very long time for him to, so. There's no point, I don't even know if you can climb these. Can you climb these? There's, there's no end. I, there's what end, I'm not sure if there, if any, because I don't see anything here. No, there's no point to going up this. You can do it, that's a nice little touch, but there's no reason to do it, doesn't look like. But I can't climb on books. Excuse me, so the only path I see upwards is this bookcase, if I can climb this. Which I can. I'm not sure how, but I can. So I'm going to have to... He's not in here anyway, so that's not that scary, but... It's fine. I just gotta wait for that to... Get a little closer. Try not to land on the keys. I landed on the keys. <laughs> well, he's not in here, so it's fine. So I just gotta go up here, because he's way down there. That's fine. He's in here. <laughs> Jeez. You leave now. Because I have a feeling if I knock any more books off the shelf, he's going to come over, reach down, and grab me. Please don't knock any more books off the shelf. Okay. We're fine for now. So I got to follow. I don't like following this thing. This guy. Oh, what the hell? Oh, that's a book. I thought that was the handle. Like, oh my god, they just put the handle right there? That's kind of anticlimactic, but okay. Is he coming back this way? He's looking over this way. Shit. Oh, I, I know he's blind, but I don't want to go right in front of him. He looks like he's going to be coming back this way. Turn around. Turn around, Leroy. I don't think his name's Leroy, for the record. I just picked a name out of a hat there. If I had, I don't wear a hat. But if I did, I'd be picking it out of it. Turn around, you jackass. Fine, I'll just go in there like a dumbass. Okay, so I can climb up this thing, hopefully, without making noise. Just gotta do a little sneaky sneaky here. And now you choose to move, of course. Stay on the books. Okay. Shit. <laughs> throw the damn thing over there. Throw it. Why do you know throw the thing when I tell you to throw it? <laughs> damn you, incongruities. I was hitting X. I think it was because I was crouched down. Uh, I was trying to throw it over to the right so he'd go over there. Okay, so at least I know generally what to do there. I think. I'm not sure. Maybe you can't actually throw that over there. Maybe you're supposed to, like, throw it back so you can, like, get him to move back and then you... I don't know. <laughs> not a huge fan of the narrow thing there anyway. It's kind of hard to navigate with me because I'm not too good at that, but... I can try. You heard that, I bet. Yeah, boy, he's gotta drop it. Aha. Uh -huh. I am doing it. 
Not in an intelligent manner, because I'm panicking now, but I'm doing this. I think he heard that shit. I just gotta hope this is the right way, because if it's not, I'm screwed. Okay. Okay, I think that was sloppy, but I did it. What the hell was- Oh, great, here's a handle. I just kinda hope this thing still works. Judging by that noise, he's coming this way. Oh my god, that is annoying as shit. This is ballsy, but I'm going to get as close to that door as I can, because hopefully he's not going to be fingering the ground all around it. Because <laughs> I need as good as much of a head start as I can get, man. This is ballsy. I think there was a shortcut I saw underneath. Yeah. Run! This is not good, running this fast, but I'm doing it. Do you blame me? I don't want to stay in there any longer than I have to. Screw that. I'm getting out of here. Okay. Now this thing is going to cause a shitload of noise. This is not good. But I guess I got to do it. He's going to be right behind me, isn't he? Okay. Okay. We should be fine. He's not even there anyway. Oh, now he's there. Apparently I did that really quickly. That's not usually so synonymous with how I do things in games, but uh, apparently I did that pretty well. I think it's because of my haste. I just got through that, but hell, it worked. Where the hell am I? Why is there a bus saw? Is that a bus saw? I don't know. What? The, the, is, this, is this upside down? I don't think bus saws are supposed to be on the ceiling, but I guess I'm glad they're not on the floor. Apparently you can grab that. I was gonna say, I don't know if I can move this. It looks awful heavy, but uh, apparently that's useful to do this. So I guess I just kind of walked my way into that. I love the puzzles in this. The puzzles are not off the wall stupid. A lot of times in puzzle platformers, they're just so off the wall like what? This one seems like they're very, very intelligent the way they design the puzzles. I like it. You know, that beating noise just kind of signifies, I thought, that the uh, guy's chasing you, so I'm kind of in a hurry here. Is, is that supposed to be the Six's heartbeat? I don't know what that is. It sounds like it's like a hurry up, you know, shit's going down moment. Good thing I moved this, too, because it looks like I needed to. Oh, shit. Oh, God. I think I let go too early. <laughs> yeah, no, okay, I thought that was like a fall there. I'm fine. It looked like a fall there. Oh shit, that's him right down there. No, that's the bodies. Okay. I don't know if you heard that door just open, but that was not me. That had to have been him. And I have nowhere to hide, nowhere to go. So, I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Oh, apparently that's what I'm supposed to do here. I'm safe inside the vents. Alright. Right. I'm safe in here. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, I thought I saw a lantern. Okay. I, I'm wrong. <laughs> I was just hallucinating because I wanted to... Oh, shit. Never mind. Light it. Thank you. Has it really been half an hour already? Hell, I guess it has. I don't like the look of those holes in the wall. For good reasons. No, 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 no. I've watched enough horror movies. I know what's going down. You move your hand. Shit. Okay, I thought I was supposed to like wait until the hand was up on the ceiling and then try and go past it, but I think I might I think you might try and sneak past it. Maybe you're supposed to just wait, I don't know. That theory did not hold water, apparently. Maybe I just attempted it in a very piss poor way. It was a good idea in theory, just not very well practiced. Or something. I'm trying to sound more intelligent than I actually am. Okay, so if the rat, if the rat goes past it, he hears the noise and he reaches inside. Okay, that makes more sense now. I was like, why did he just do that now all of a sudden? Oh, no, no, no. Don't grab me from over there. It's not like he can see in here anyway. Let me try sneaking past when his arms go up. 
You wait for his arms to go up again. They don't see they don't seem to be leaving. Okay, so you had to sneak past it. I just got a little antsy and panicked there. Okay. Are there any other holes in the walls? Doesn't appear to be so. That gave me a little bit of a fright. Let's turn off the lantern. I don't think it matters because he's blind anyway, but still. He doesn't appear to be in here. There's like a laundry room of sorts. Maybe, I don't know. Oh shit. Oh, that's just shit. Okay, so you're supposed to run there. I can, okay, I will just say he heard me land, I guess. I'm not sure how. It looked like I was landing on something soft, but I guess that could have made a splashy noise or a, I don't know what the hell noise, but run! Shit. Don't know where I'm going. Okay, now I slid there. I slid there, and you know it. That was a dirty pull, mister. Dirty pull, mister. I'll get it eventually. Don't worry. I'm stubborn like that. Okay, so we just gotta time our slide better, because I think I lost my momentum there for a second. Yep, that's what that was. Okay, don't grab at me, you dick. Oh god, no! He's not gonna give up, is he? Okay, well, I don't know how his hands can hear me, but I guess he could hear me through the... I don't know what the hell I'm supposed to do there. I have a guess, but I'm not sure how I'm supposed to go about it. The only thing I can assume is that I gotta try and... I'm not very good. Those hands are, like, more... better hearing than I am. I'm not sure when I'm supposed to... I, the only thing I can assume is just try and get rid of the thing under the door. Okay? But, so, but I gotta try and get near the door without getting grabbed. And then I don't know how you do that without getting grabbed by the hands. Well, I almost had that. <laughs> Except I ran, I think, is what the problem was there. This is gonna take a while. Oh, yeah. This is, a, this is gonna take a while. I'm not good with puzzle bosses. You know the worst part about this? I know exactly what I'm supposed to do, but I just kind of keep getting either at the worst possible time, his hands just, like, after I've already done what I'm supposed to do, he just grabs me anyway when he's supposed to be in his recovery frames. So it's just kind of like crap. You have to have, like, pixel-perfect timing and placement to get this done. Otherwise, that left hand comes back and gets you every time. Well, finally, he didn't just grab me on the rebound that time. Because that's what he does. Every other time he grabbed me on the first rebound after he, that the first one failed. Okay, now, you're going to lose an arm or two this way if you keep this up. If you're going to keep doing this. I'm telling you, man, you're going to lose your arms if you don't stop this shenanigans here. You're done. Yeah. Yeah. Look at how tough your arms are now. Yeah. Oh, shit. Damn residual electro things in the body. I don't know what the hell they're called. <laughs> but yeah, don't try and grope six. She, and she doesn't like it. That's not cool. Don't do that. Kind of put, kind of justice, really. Now he's just kind of screwed those little arms of his, and apparently that was the lair. Those little arms, those little legs of his, excuse me, and... So I guess he, I guess we just kind of left him to die of exsanguination because he's going to bleed to death. That boss fight took four minutes. It doesn't seem like, it should seem like it took longer because it took me like 10, 12 attempts just to finally get the positioning right. And then another five attempts just to get the timing right. So I didn't get, so I didn't, didn't get grabbed during his recovery frames. Anyway, that's been about 40 minutes, so that's a good time to call it a day for today. Thank you very much for watching, and hopefully I shall see you next time. Farewell, everyone. Until then.